Hey everyone, this is J Dog, and I'm here with another video. Once again, I had to talk about Crybaby Jones himself, Van Jones. And I just said his insulting nickname that I came up with, Crybaby Jones. Because this dude just likes to cry and act like a baby on TV all the time. He, he's just moist. So, what has he done to piss me off now? Well, he went at some kind of event that I can care less and said, and said that he apologizes for black people silent on Ye, which is, you know, the rapper, Ye. Um, and the thing about anti um, sem, uh, Semitism, so called anti Semitism. Yeah, he's trying to make it look like black people are the most anti Semitist, um, uh, are, are the most anti Jewish. That, that that's that's what your Van Jones is say, saying, which is not true. Um, there um, Van Jones doesn't talk about the times other communities have attacked the black community, um, and a lot of people are calling out Van Jones for his comments at the this um anti anti Semitic event that happened. Um, and then now a couple, I think a couple days ago later. He, there's been people saying that he's been trying to backpedal and stuff like that because a lot of people, including myself, is on social media. I have actually was recently on Twitter um, calling out Van Jones for his selling out and buffoonery um, over what's been going on because we don't see him call out other groups about when they attack black people, but when, when just... But when it comes to situations involving other groups, he will try to make it look like bad black people are the problem. And that's why Van Jones is getting called out. Just like Stephen A. Smith and Charles Barkley are also getting called out for their stupidity. Uh, I did a video talking about both Charles Barkley and Stephen A. Smith on their 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 buffoonery and their selling out and now I'm calling out Van Jones for him selling out and stuff like that. Van Jones is just a sell out, ladies and gentlemen. Van Jones is just a sell out. He will say all kinds of insults towards the black community on CNN or or just anything to please his white handlers on CNN. And yeah, especially on CNN because he works for CNN. Now, yes, we understand why you talk about anti-Semitism because this dude, for those who may not know, he's a black Jewish man, all right? Yes, I mean, see, him talking about anti-Semitism is not the problem. We understand why he may be affected by anti-Semitism because he is—he's—he's—he's he's, he's a Jewish person. Van Jones does practice the Jewish faith because, yes, he's yeah. There is black Jewish people. In fact, the original Jews—what people said that the original Jews, many people say that the Hebrews are the original Jews who happened to look black or black people that that's what what the film that Hebrews and what they were talking about when it came to the film Hebrews and Negroes um that's what they were talking about because we are supposed to be the original people and are that our religion that our, our part in the religion has been stolen and then you have racists within the J community that says that that's a lie and that black people, but you have a black Jewish man right here. That's pr more proof that we are some of the original to chosen people is what you call. But the problem with Van Jones is he's being a sellout. Um, Yeah, he's, he's being a sellout. He's been nothing more than their puppet to attack black people with. And that's why people are calling out your Van Jones. And I have made comments on his Twitter accounts. So far, he has not responded, which I, 
ironically, but I know that he is feeling the pressure. And rightfully so. That's why I liked how people are finally putting the pressure on Stephen A. Smith. Well, put people on Charles Barkley, so now people are putting the pressure on Van Jones for his selling out and stuff like that. And we need to keep putting pressure. It's time we start calling out these sellouts. These, yeah, these buck dancers. Yeah, uh, when they try to make the black community look bad, they try to weaken the black community, try to come at the black community, and they are from our community. We need to call them out. We need to show that we're we're sick and tired of this. But that's all I have to say about this situation with Van Jones. Van Jones could just go to hell as all as I care. But I want to know what y'all think in the comment section. Write down in the comment section what y'all think. Make sure you hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed. And hit that notification bell. And I hope to catch y'all in another video. Um, this is J-Dog. Thank you for watching. Peace, everyone.